and welcome to Simon 2. Welcome back with the another episode about the Mazda 6 2002. I'm gonna check them all up today and take off the rear wheels and uh, to do to pull these things out and uh, do the muffler. No tips on the back. We're gonna put the extra new tips on the back, make it look good, and um, we will find out. We're gonna do rainbow look red. And we have to order rear wheel bearing. So one of these rear wheel bearing making noise. So like that. See when you drive really fast and it sees up as well. What we do we uh, have to order another rear wheels bearing and put on. Make it nice and quiet, okay? So small time being now, we cover up like that and uh, painting this caliper in red and repair the rear disc as well so <clears throat> we paint this one in silver tomorrow we take this one for machine to uh, silver to stop the rusts out to protection the disc new bearing hubs install them on perfectly no more noise that's that that's what i want now put the disc back everything together and time for body kit jobs we've been taken to machine as well so front and rear dish are fully fresh faces and I believe this car breaks like brand new car looking so terrible with the red caliber huh I like it look like rainbow huh rainbow okay like that let's put this one on and it's in place that's it we need two hands pick up the rubbers there pick up the rubber there and put the bolt through okay looking brand banking new and the should be look like that okay no more touching about the car mechanical now now we're touching the body been pulled as much as i could that's it and now we're gonna straight the lip it up and uh body filler all the way around and here i'm making a puller and i make myself pull out with the gap and pull it out some from the door So you could see here. Okay. What we do is slap it on. You will see. So now, see just like that, and use slam hammer. See he come out. See it come out now that's it what we do is take this one up now see straight a little bit later we stand back and put body filler a little bit and fill that up the gap later take up the trims all done now go down here for the next one okay same way one day I cut him straight a little bit now. See coming out, see? Beautiful, straight. Yeah. Okay, and we uh, pull a little bit more here. Later, send it back, seal them up, okay? This is the quick way, you don't have to take up the uh, door. Okay, same way. See this? Go in there. Okay, here we go. Stop it. See this one? This one's straight. One more here, one more here, and you can pull it out.
this one we can uh, fill it up with the body filler, make it flat flat. And I put one more pool here, so shake this plastic out a little bit more. See? We'll pull this one out straight, and this one automatically gets straight a little bit. It's alright, that's it. We don't want to touch any more further. Done. We're gonna snap this one back a little bit. However, the see the deep, the high of this one, we're gonna make it same level with this one, and we send it back, body filler, and send back, body filler. See? This is very handy. Very handy tools. Slam hammer. I go around. One more check before I do anything else. See, so I have to do any other things. So this side, see this side, little bit things there, but it's not a big deal. It's actually not a big deal. You can have your hammer here and pull from here. See this line, you can pull from here, but it's not a big deal. I don't touch it. Body filler and then undercoat this part first. Spray on the coat and we do the front bumper first and we do the side later okay front bumper first and all around later no time take it easy baby all the wheels been uh, under coat primer this one primer primer and front bumper rumba so what we do rumba over here today and wait for it dry and spray gold color in white red dot finish all the wheels went till tomorrow try and put them on this one there and I finish the bumper tomorrow now we're gonna spray the clear coat on and then we have the front end beautifully okay that's how it looks The four go wheels on with this one it's matching the car now so far just a little bit look I believe after we put everything back together it's looking mint beautiful waiting waiting for the two fork light to turn up two fork light and everything all right how's the look not bad not bad on the back here look all right for it to try and sand it down in the gap that's all we can do but uh, we keep sand it down and still have to fill it up more until you seal everything all around even the side door here so we're gonna sand it all down and uh, painting so patient okay so we keep sand it down and then you see any how or any bubble we have to put up more and keep sanding sanding until you get a perfect good look Okay, that's all I can do. Send back everything and uh, ready to wrap up and paint this side. And it gotta be look good. Coats and sticker ready to paint the pants on today. And wait for it to try. And it's super shiny everywhere. No runs at all. What a good painter.
okay almost everything else the car all have the same color all rail and the top one I wait to try and I can lean on the top and take all that one off and I'll be complete the car you see the back of the car looking great very shiny no runs no runs at all you see all rail the car well we have to just wait for complete the um, radio <laughs> just put the radio on and uh, we get retro transfer and uh, get registered for my nephew car and he can get it down the road uh, this is all about the car thank you uh, thank you for watching Simon Tools and I hope you uh, understand a little bit of this and how you do your car this is how I do the car all gold rail all gold right fork lights gold and all gold gold it's good to go look like brand new car thanks for watching Simon Tools see you in the next videos